Hi, my name is Ted. Today I'm going to show you how to change a letter to a number in Excel. By this what I mean is uh, we want a formula where A becomes 1, B becomes 2, and so on. So I've got a spreadsheet set up here where I'm going to show you the, the steps needed and it's actually fairly simple but there's the one thing you need to know is a, is a certain function in Excel called code. And what that is, if, you, if you've uh, done anything with computers um, where you know, actually I'm not going to say that, that sounds snotty. So I've got, a, I've got a spreadsheet set up here and uh, to show the steps involved. And the first thing that uh, is needed is, is a function called code. And what that is, is every character in the computer, not just letters, but numbers and all special characters, has a certain code assigned to it that the computer uh, understands and, and because it has to convert everything into numbers to do anything with it. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into this column B where, where I have the, the heading is called code and we're going to say equals code, C-O-D-E, and then open parenthesis and then uh, click the cell where the letter A is and close the parenthesis and hit return. And what that means is that the code for the letter A in a computer is 65. And if we take that formula and drag it down, and that's a capital A, it's important, it's a different for the capital letters than for the lowercase letters. So let's take that formula and um, what you can do if you want to copy a formula down is just to move the cursor to the bottom right of the cell and turn, until it turns to a, a solid plus sign and then just drag, whoops, and then just drag it down and it copies the formula into all the other cells um, using the same r relative uh, reference of, of the cells that's, that it's doing calculations from. Oops, I forgot one here. Um, what we see is that uh, the code for capital A is 65, capital B is 66, all the way down to capital G is 71. Then the code for a lowercase a is 97. So what we want to do is we want to, we actually want a to be 1. So what we're going to do, the number is going to be the code minus 64, and you'll see what happens. So that equals this minus 64, hit return. So there we go, A is 1, B is 2, C is 3, and so on, and there we go. And for the lowercase a, we want that to be equals this minus 96. You've probably figured this out by now. And sure enough, there we go. Um, so there we go. The, so you could actually put it all in a single formula. And we'll just say equals code of the letter, close parentheses, minus 64. And, you know, copy that formula down. So all, all in, one, in one formula is the whole thing and then the same thing for the lowercase letters except instead of 64 that magic number is going to be 96 so I'll go in and change that and uh, there we go drag that down and now we've got it all in one nice formula so I don't need those cells anymore so I just delete those and, and uh, so there we go so in th there's the letter and there's the number um, and if you, you know, if you, if you want to try, a, try to find a way to make it so that a single formula handles, handles both the lowercase and the uppercase letters, uh, feel free. But uh, I hope this has been helpful to, to show you a formula where you can change a letter to a number in Excel. So thank you for watching. I'm Ted, and I've shown you how to change a letter to a number in Excel. Thank you for watching.